So behaviour change has always been um, an evolving area as we get more familiar with the behavioural influences, uh, we get better at understanding all the different ways that we can influence someone's behaviour. In the last couple of years, post-pandemic and moving forwards, the challenge for governments arguably become even harder because there are new behavioural challenges, there are new um, things that governments are trying to address and there will likely be lifelong impacts of some of those. So I think there's certainly a lot of challenges that lie ahead. The popularization of behavioral science has given us a wealth of new insights into how humans really behave and a more rigorous mindset approach towards forming hypotheses, testing interventions and evaluating its impact. There's a growing need to draw on a wide toolbox of techniques such as design thinking, data analytics and even now futures thinking to understand the full range of influences on human behaviour as well as the lens of local culture, future trends. To spot opportunities that exist across different policy levers, control, design, persuade and educate. This programme allows participants to discover new methods and tools for measuring and understanding behaviour and it aims to sharpen their skills in designing, planning, executing and evaluating large and small-scale behaviour change interventions across different policy areas and programmes. Through lectures and hands-on workshops, participants will be brought through a step-by-step -step process in exploring how they can use behaviour change as a way to guide their policy development. It places the human-centred approach at the heart of policy making and considers individuals' physical, social and psychological tendencies in shaping policy decisions and choices.